Hey everybody out there, this is Chris Nicholson. I'm just showing you my new teddy bear costume. Right now, this is just basically um, the bare bone structure of it. And as you can see, I'm using a lot of foam. So this foam you could buy at Joanne Fabrics. And um, I already had some foam already in there. These are the teddy bear shoes. Uh, it's gonna have actually soles on them. Here's inside the costume right here. As you can see, it's nothing but foam. Let's see if I could go around so you can see it a little bit better. That's what it is. So my legs are gonna step inside there. And here is the back of the costume right here. So I have to start from the ground up. Basically the way how I would design it. You know, a bear is supposed to be a humongous figure. And so I started from the ground up uh, the hula hoop is supporting it. It's standing up by, its, uh, by itself. So that's the main thing about it is that the costume, if I basically um, get out of the costume, it has to stand up by itself and still present itself, even though if I'm out of the costume. Now, I'm going to put this um, camera on a stand so I can show you. I can show you me and the costume together. See if we can get this straight for you guys. There we go. And so yes, here is the costume, and here is me. As you see, it goes up to my chest right over here. So with the boots, uh, what I'm actually gonna do, everything is separate right now, so I can take this off, and these two are separate right over here. It's very, very lightweight. It's not like the other costume that I had. It was heavy, I used heavier materials. This is much lighter materials, um, and it's very lightweight. So with the boots, um, even though, as you can see, my leg is right here, I'm gonna try to see if I can elevate it just a little bit to right over here, so I could be a little bit more on top and be elevated. Uh, so this is gonna be basically a nine foot teddy bear. It's gonna be it's gonna tower, it's gonna be big. I'm gonna try to see if I can make the head to the ceiling, basically, um, if I could. Um, if not, then plan B, you know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna still try to make it so I can still walk out the door if I can. Um, on top of that, this, uh, this suit, as, as I stand behind it, as you can see, comes up to right here. But as I said, I'm gonna be a little bit more elevated, um, more stable. Um, and the costume is going to stand up by itself. So if I'm out of the costume, I can prop it up and it'll still stand up by itself just like that. Um, it's going to be, it's going to have AC unit inside of it. So I'm, I'm designing an AC unit system around the rim, around the top. So where the belly is going to be, uh, that's probably, probably going to be where the battery is going to be. Um, there's going to be an AC unit system in here and also there's going to be basically a like a little TV monitor screen so I can see outside and it's gonna be a camera like a GoPro or something it's gonna be a camera that's gonna look outside probably from the nostrils or um, inside the mouth and stuff like that and I'm gonna have like probably two cameras one outside um, looking forward and one looking backwards and of course I'll be AC in here I have my own snacks <laughs> So this is my this is my own unit right over here. So if I'm inside the costume, um, what I plan to do if I'm inside the costume is to be fully fully equipped. Uh, just in case of any kind of emergency, I'll have a first aid kit and everything inside here just in case if anything fails. Um, so right now I'm building the costume early, so when Halloween comes or an event comes, I have it ready and I know exactly what I'm doing. Um, I've been building teddy bear costumes for a very long time, um, and one of them passed. I'm going to be honest with you, one of them passed, but I almost died in that costume because it was too heavy and lots of things went wrong, wrong with that costume. But this is much more lighter materials, and um, it's, it's, it's much better. So um, if I take this off, it's very, very light, and this is the torso. So this is the front, and right here is the back, and um, here's the two legs right over here, which is really cool. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this forward and put 
on the legs. So that's one. And that's two. So this is me standing with the legs right here. And I can, I can walk around real nicely, which is very good. Uh, so the costume actually, right in the groin area, has actually a gap. So I have to, I have to basically walk like this, you know, back and forth. So um, me being in the costume, and I, I don't know if I should try this, but let me, let me see if I could. It might not be good, but <laughs> let me see if I could. Um, now, to, for me to know what the back is, this area where it's kind of cushioned is more of the butt area. So this goes in here. And I don't know if you guys can actually see this. Let me move the legs out the way. But that's how the costume is right here. It goes to my um, chest area. But let's see if I can do this on camera and put the legs on. I might need a little bit of stabilization. And that went well. Look at that, that went well right there. And the other one right here. Actually, that went well. And this comes up to right here, so that's good. So let's see if I can move around and walk around in the costume, which is very good. Nice. Yeah, so I gotta secure these uh, shoes a little bit better. Ta da, everybody! So if I dance around and everything. So, as I said, I'm gonna design a top. Uh, probably come up to here, and the, the, the head is gonna be to the ceiling. But it has to, main, main part about it, it has to be lightweight materials that I can move around in the costume. Just like this which is pretty cool so what do you guys think um, as I said I'm gonna be I'm gonna have this all probably strapped together um, and then I could just crawl into the costume this way uh, but what do you guys think do you think this is good um, a lot of people say how are you gonna get in um, okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have the top over me um, but it has to be in a way that it's gonna actually just latch on and I'm going to have Velcro probably right around this area. Um, this hula hoop right over here, like hopefully I, can, I can't bend down, but <laughs> let's see if I can get it. Here we go. This hula hoop right here, um, it actually has a hula hoop, a smaller one, right over here. So the big part is going to have a hula hoop basically right over here. And the belly, it's going gonna, it's gonna to probably go down like to right here, and the belly's going to overhang. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to overhang. A little bit you know and then so when I get out the costume I could just lift this up or just take the front part off and then put it aside get back in just like that but it's still in the works everybody so this is early this is this is basically um, very early before Halloween um, and I'm not gonna just use it for Halloween I'm gonna use it for other events right here but um, this is a lot better than the costume that I had before. Um, so to tell you, the costume that I had before, I almost died in it. The AC system cut off just like that, um, which this time I'm gonna make it more reliable. Uh, I did have an AC system and it frees my body inside. So I have to have a temperature control that it's not gonna freeze my body. I had a light inside so I could see. Um, and I saw, I basically was, watching everything out the mouth. So um, this time I wanna watch it through a screen and have everything really good. The arms are gonna be hanging down. It's gonna be like, you know, he's gonna be a fat boy basically. It's gonna be a real big humongous fat boy uh, teddy bear costume. And for me to have a teddy bear costume in Wilton Manors, I know something is gonna happen to me because um, I tell you this, I'll tell you guys what happened in another video. <laughs> Very funny things happen. So, okay, everybody, do me a favor. Click like, subscribe, follow me and everything. And um, what do you think? This is going to be my new layout, my new bare bone for the teddy bear costume. 
And as I said, it's gonna have battery operated. I'm gonna have everything. Even, even inside the costume, it's gonna be a charging station for my phone. Um, and a whole power source. I'm gonna make sure the power source lasts at least a whole day if I needed to, because it's not gonna be that many electronics to actually be hooked up to it. But, um, you know, and also make sure I don't electrocute myself. All right, everybody, click like, subscribe, follow me on everything. The new teddy bear costume. Uh, you know, everybody calls me golden, well, it used to be brown bear, but now it's going brown bear. So click like, subscribe, follow me on everything. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Bye-bye, everybody. Mwah.